a couple of months ago, Microsoft previewed this notion of a Microsoft Edge game assist feature, which is basically a mini game or a Microsoft Edge browser inside of the game bar. And it is now available and stable. So you have to go find it in Edge and enable it. It's not there by default. But once you do, I'm doing this now just to look at it. You can bring up uh, the game bar. And then one of the available floating widgets you can have is this little browser. Huh. And I guess I guess there are going to be automatic experiences you get. So if you're I, I can't, I'm using an Oh, arm. this is cool. Yeah. So it's so like I a little have... walkthrough of the game that you can watch while that's you're right. in the game. So I just oh, did like cool. a Google search for a game walkthrough just to, just to see it. But I mean... There's a little, um, uh, they call it Oh, so maps. you explicitly, ex- explicitly I, looked for it. Well, I did because I'm not running a game. But depending right. on the game, it will actually just come up automatically, right? So uh, which is kind of cool. With, a, with AI. Um, yeah, that is cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's kind of neat. I so see. It's, good, it's like Clippy. I see you're yeah. playing, you know, well, Crisis. Look, th- no one who has played a video game of any kind has ever not gone to a web browser and typed right. in how do I dot yeah. dot name of game. Is that okay? So That's allowed because I do that. And I, I'm, of course, everyone, I does feel like this. it's I mean, cheating. No, it's come on. I, I'm trying to have fun, not, you know, I'm not trying to crack That's a true. puzzle here. Yeah. That's true. No, it's not I'm a really, test. 